there's a column for I think kind of like what you're saying like give them the opportunity to mm -hmm. think on their own and write something down mm -hmm. um, but I think to get all of us on board on how to implement it is something I'm kind of like wanting to have that discussion about um, what um, story like else do we need to like the story we need to think of and like what things we're learning in the class as at one of our standards right now kind of like throwing a lot out there well I know when kids are younger, just getting them to be able to talk, you usually want to go with something that they have um, already some like prior experience. But with fourth grade now, you know, we still have to think of the expectation of where we want them to be at the end of the year. So I still think we should have um, a text that's like engaging enough that they want to talk about it, mm -hmm. but that it still would give the opportunity for like more than one answer so it's not like we talk about thick versus thin so it's not like a just right there type of question okay. like we need to think of something that could open up that dialogue so that when they talk to their partner that they're not just like i think this line and i think that and they get the same exact answer i like the idea when you're saying something that students are interested in talking about um something that they get that's not dry yeah, no, it has to definitely be exciting because high otherwise, interest, yeah, yeah mm -hmm. high interest for sure. Um, what do you think about um, using your scholastic and your grievance for some of your students, like, who need that support? I think so, because anytime we read scholastic things, they're very interested in the stories. I, I mean, your class has pretty much quite a bit of also EL mm -hmm. students, so I think that would be good. Like, you've read it before. Yeah, we've read it before, and they, and they really enjoy it. Oh, good. They're really, they're high interest and they're like easily approached, like especially mm -hmm. with the graphics. It's mm -hmm. not like we're something that's really text heavy too. I think there's mm -hmm. that thing too where it's that, you know, it's it's accessible for your ELs and interesting. I think that'd be a good choice. Okay, can I show you next month or is it this month that I, I just got in the mail? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know. Right? <laughs> They're so good. I know. It makes me want to read. They're good. So even. this is about a girl. Um, looks like she has water bottles. She's caring a lot about um, helping the helping the community out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, Flint, Michigan has mm -hmm. the water situation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I think it'll be interesting. Um, I had a question for my students the other day where they had to talk about what's something they want to do in the world, and a lot of them are interested in the environment.